Printing is a process of decorating textile fabrics by application of pigments, dyes, or other related materials in the form of patterns. Block printing is a method of printing textiles by stamping ink-dipped blocks usually made from wood onto a fabric. One of the wonderful things about block printing is that you have absolute control over the colors, motif, and repeat of your print. Welcome to Textile Vlog, be with us and enrich your textile knowledge. In this video, we will see the complete process of block printing. The first step of block printing is to sketch the design on a paper. It is important to reverse the image if you are using text, as the printed image will be the reverse of what is on the block. Once your image is ready, you have to transfer the design onto the wood or linoleum to get an outline of where to carve. The next step is to carve the design. You have to carve away the parts that you don't want to print, as the ink will be applied to the raised surfaces to print the design. Whatever surface is untouched will be what prints onto the paper. The fabric to be printed is washed free of starch and soft bleached. If dyeing is required, as in the case of Ceres, where borders or the body is tied and dyed, it is done before printing. The cloth to be printed is spread on a table, either gummed in position or pinned to a back cloth attached to the table. This is an important stage, as there should be a uniform tension in the fabric and no ripples. A piece of woolen fabric was stretched on smaller frame to make a color pad. First print past is applied on the pad by a brush. Then color is applied evenly to the block and the pattern is stamped on the fabric to be printed using the handle of a small heavy hammer or mall to aid penetration of the paste. The most important part is applying the pressure evenly since the color will be stronger in some areas of the print than others if uneven pressure is applied. After the fabric has been entirely printed with one color, other colors are applied in the same way until the design is complete. Dry from a clothesline until the fabric and ink are completely dry. Although block printing is becoming too laborious and costly for commercial use, some of the most beautiful prints have been made in this way. 